Hello, good people. Hello, hello. I am Dr. Holly Kelly, and this is Dr. Kelly's Perspective for Thursday, March 2nd, 2017. Okay, so you know we're making our way through, and we are almost at the end of Dr. John Maxwell's 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership. And so today we have come to the law of sacrifice. Law of sacrifice says, look, leaders, you've got to give up in order to go up. You've got to give up in order to go up. When you think about um, Gandhi, Mother Teresa, Dr. King, Nelson Mandela, Jesus Christ, all of them had tremendous uh, personal, financial, family, relational sacrifices that were made. Hey, Marcel, all of them had to give up. And the thing leaders need, all leaders have to recognize, remember, and, and um, agree to is that you are going to have to be willing to make sacrifices in order to lead well. Too many of us have gotten in uh, the misperception that getting to the top is the golden ticket. Whoo, I have arrived. I've got, you know, the bank account is growing. I've got the power. I've got the position of authority. And guess what? Now I get to relax. I am at the top. I get to relax. All that going without, doing without, sacrificing I made as I was climbing the ladder. Okay, that's over because I'm at the top. That is a misperception. All leaders have to give up in order to go up because success without sacrifice does not exist. Period. You cannot be successful without sacrifice. The higher you go, the more you are going to have to give up. There are trade-offs and we've got to recognize that. I, I clearly remember when I decided that it was time to... Um, hang up my uniform. And I have to say, I loved, 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 loved being a United States Marine and everything that went with it. The entire lifestyle just suited me very well. Um, but there came a point in time when I had to decide if, you know, continuing in an active duty status and uh, was it worth what I was going to have to trade off? Because I heard one too many times, Mommy, you didn't make my recital. Mommy, you missed my play. Okay, I heard that one too many times. And, and the trade off for me was clear and distinct. Every one of you will have to make that call in, in relationships, in careers, um, especially when you are leading people. The, the greater the responsibilities you accept, the fewer the options you will have. Your time is not your own the higher you climb. Your calendar is not your own. Leaders, hear me. You will never reach a point that you have made it and now you no longer have to sacrifice. Uh, Dr. Maxwell uses this analogy, which is so on point. It's like an auction. In an auction at the beginning, everybody is participating, you got a million people playing, they all, you know, I'm in, I'm in, because the price is low. The higher that price climbs, you look around, there are fewer and fewer people in the game. Leadership is no same. It, uh, leadership is exactly the same. The higher you climb, the fewer people there are because the price tag becomes too high. The sacrifice can be great. Are you willing to accept the sacrifices. You know, some of you are in positions and your teams, your company, your schools, your organizations are hurting because you're no longer willing to make the sacrifice. And it doesn't work like that. There's, there's some thought pattern that now you've arrived. It doesn't work like that. Leaders must be willing to make the sacrifice because you've got to give up in order to go up. Okay, think about that, leaders. Challenge yourself. Be honest. Pull that mirror out and look. Are you still making the sacrifices that are necessary to grow your team? 
Until next time, take real good care.